Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you <clears throat> my American Girl's house. I know I do these videos a lot, but um, you never saw this in a video before. <laughs> never, ever, ever. <clears throat> and I kind of have a sore throat, but I make do. So, here are all my dolls. The first doll is Sage, Sage Copeland, and I'll just show you them what their, I'll just show you what their hair, hair style is. Hers is just a big fishtail braid. <coughs> then I have Alex, which you can't even see her face. Gosh. Can't see it, but she just has nothing in her hair. I've never done her hair. She's not a real American girl doll. Um, she's like a doll collector thing, like I say in a lot of my videos. And then I have MM, and in her hair, there's two little fishtail braids. I don't know if you could tell. It's a fishtail braid. Yeah, you can't tell. That's another fishtail braid. That one you could sort of tell. But. And then I have them clipped back. Now on to the house tour. So this is... Up. Well, I'm going to tell you... I'm going to tell you not to scream because... This is the top. Down, 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 down. All the way to me. Okay. Now, so the first thing we have is Amam's room. She has a little poster on the wall that says her name. Has a lot of pearler beads on it. Posters, you know. Then she has a lot of stuffed animals scattered on her bed with her pillow. Then if you go, there's a lot of, like, junk on the floor. And in that dresser is all kinds of knickknacks. She has her, like, flashlight and electronics on top. And I want to show you this really quick. What you can, just a neat craft idea. It's a duct tape bow. And, um... It's really cool. So all you do is take your duct tape, get out a strip if you have the big duct tape, which I don't. If you have little duct tape, put two pieces of tape together and then cover the back and the piece, the like kind of tape that you want to use for like the holding bow part. And then, yeah, just and then wrap a piece of tape around to make the middle and put in a puppy pin. So that's really easy. Um, so yeah, that was my mom's room. Now up to the hair room thing. Okay. There's a lot of hair ties over here. Uh, a brush, the toothbrush for sage, hair bands and hair stuff. Clips, a little chicky, and the the hair holder stand. Like not the hair holder stand thing. Um, the dowel stand. Now we're gonna move up to the living room. So first thing you see is the little trash can that I put random things in there. Crumpled up tape, <laughs> a lot of stuff. Then I made them this couch. It's just white. It's kind of a boring couch, but they stand on it pretty stay on it pretty good. And I have their little pet, Sugar, which I just named it Sugar because I, I don't know. Because um yeah. Hold on. My brother is in here. 
Okay. You can. Hold on, I'm just talking to my brother. Um, there's Sugar and her little dog, Matt, thing. I made her. And then there's their arts and crafts table. There's Play-Doh, all kinds of glues and paper. And now to get to the next floor, I need a special. So let me get one. As you can see, I'm going to stand on this thing. Okay. Well, this is the trundle bunk bed. So, here's the trundle. No one sleeps there. I would have to, like, risk my life using this. So, yeah. Then we go up. This is Alex's bunk. She has her big, enormous pillow and all her stuffed animals. And now I cannot even see the top where Sage loops, so I'm gonna see if you guys can see it. So I can see it. Okay, so there's her name, Sage. And then all of her animals. Uh, and her pillows and the flag and everything. Okay, I hope you saw that pretty good. And that is the end of my dollhouse. I will give you one last overview. And it's almost touching my ceiling. Not almost, but like if you added a few more bunk beds, it would. Hold on, let me get one whole thing together. That's it. Thank you guys for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe.